Hello and welcome to our tutorial on Google Drive. This explores the settings. Woohoo! We're going to take a look at the settings. So I'm going to go ahead and find my cog and I'm going to click on my cog and then of course I'm going to go and look at the settings. Now I'm not going to talk about all the settings but I want to highlight a few specific settings. First of all you can see your storage um, and you can view some of your storage details and items that are taking up storage. Now if you are in a school um, based Google domain that means you have unlimited storage. The big one actually I want to touch on is convert uploads. Um, let's say that you have Word docs and or PowerPoints and you want to automatically convert those to Google files uh, when they're uploaded. If that's the case and you want to convert files automatically you're going to want to check this box and when you upload a PowerPoint it's going to convert to a Google slide deck. However um, that will interfere with the formatting so sometimes what I'd like to do if it's some old documents um, is I like to keep the original so I'll turn that off, upload the file, and then I can open it um, within Google Docs. Um, another, I think, important one in here is offline. Um, if For Google Docs, you need to have internet access. If you want it so you do not have internet access, you can go ahead and click this, and um, this will let you open and edit recent uh, Google Docs sheet slides uh, from this specific device while offline. So basically it will download those uh, onto uh, a file on your computer. Um, this is not recommended for public computers because that means anybody uh, on that public computer can access your documents. Um, for me, those are kind of the big ones that I want to focus on. You can see some of the other things that are in here is, you know, Google Photos folder. So basically if you're, um, if you have Google Photos, um, it would create a folder of those photos in your drive. I have that turned off because um, on some of my accounts, uh, Google Photos do take up space. Um, another one you might want to check out is your notifications. Um, and it's just letting you uh, decide do you want to get your updates on Google Drive at all? I don't, I don't necessarily need updates. Um, maybe if somebody shares a file with you that might be nice. Um, but for me not on this account. Or do you want to get them a pop up in your browser? So it pops up, look, oh right here. Okay, um, and so maybe I want to have that pop up off. The finally, manage your apps. So these are basically uh, apps that are connected to your uh, Google um, drive. A lot of these you're going to want to leave on, but as you use this more, you may ha have some different apps in there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click done. Again, here's your setting right there. Hopefully that helps you understand um, some of the settings um, that are in here. Um, the biggest one I kind of talked about is the converting uploads from other files into a Google format, and then I think the offline storage. Um, and so uh, uh, if you want to, if you need to, go ahead and watch this video again. Hope this helps, and have a great day.